we haven't spoke about I, we haven't spoke about Louisville in a a, a glowing fashion on any episode yet, right? We have, yeah, we have been very disrespectful. We've, 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 we've touched surface and said they're playing good. And then we instantly go to talk about somebody else. If people just looked at us from the outside in of based off our content, they would think we are definitely Colorado fans. <laughs> <laughs> but, but I mean, naturally, they would, they would think, they would think it's just Colorado. Colorado's just turning up. Like I mean, it's not even so much they turning up. It's just like they just in the spotlight, and it's just like, yeah. damn. But like as local fans, yeah, we've definitely done a disservice to our so called team. For sure. I mean, like, but then I'm I'm not gonna say like yeah, we named some players and stuff and everything, but like we ain't talked about like the coaching staff and the changes they've made and like how great the defense has been playing, bro. The fact that the defense, bro, like uh, who who we fucking play? North Carolina State. We played yeah. North Carolina State, bro. Yeah. And our defense held us in that game, bro, by pitching a shutout in the second half. For sure. So it's like, bro, like for sure they did they fucking thing, bro. And this defense is looking like the like, defense is like looking Teddy better. Teddy Bridgewater and them defense, like the, the defense like, is like, looking better than what I originally thought. Um, going into the season, I didn't have I didn't have any concerns about the offense. I felt like the offense was going to be good enough to keep us in games and win games. My issue was always can this can the defense play good? Can they not give up 30, 40 points in a game? Would they would they not lay down early when it looks rough? Like would they fight? Would they and they done I'm, that I'm, all I'm, year. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm I watched the entire Notre Dame game. Yeah, I did too. I, I watched the, the I, I watched the whole game and shout out to Plummer. He didn't turn the ball over. What he had did he throw a pick or did he fumble? We did have one turnover. I think he threw a pick. Yeah, we had one turnover. But I think cool. he threw a pick. But overall he protected the ball. But he's got this weird complex where like instead of throwing the ball away, bro, like he'll just throw it call himself throwing it in open space. On the field, and it's just like, bro, you like you ask him to be picked off. Yeah, yeah, no. Or like but, he could be going down, and then at the last second, he's trying to like launch it, and then now, now you got this ball just floating in the air. Just anybody can go get who's yeah. ever the fast, fastest man, first okay. one to the to the go ball, go get it. Yeah, type shit. And it's just like, bro, I don't, I don't know why he does that. When it's like, bro, you'd be better off just taking the sack. But other than that, I think Jake Plum is playing pretty good, man. I was kind of suspect about him against North Carolina State just because, like, they stunk it up. But he played his fucking ass off, bro, against Notre Dame. Like, did his thing. Yeah. Yeah. Offensively I mean, and defensively, bro. Like, this is the Louisville team that I've been, like, waiting to see again type shit. Like, I've been, I've been, I'll say tolerable for a while. What are you talking about the team? Yeah. No, the team's been ass. And that's what I'm saying. I've been tolerable. Like I've been tolerating oh, yeah, yeah, being yeah, yeah. a fan. No, you've been suffering. And watching watching the game. Been like, suffering. Yeah, been suffering, suffering. But like tolerating because I'm a fan of the team. So it's like to- tolerating is like tolerating is like is like I'ma still watch. That's what and I'm I'ma still entertain. I, I, okay. That speaking for yourself. Okay. Speaking for yourself. I didn't tolerate these niggas at all. Like I, told bro, I swear you and Crumby was the same. Like, I call, I call Crumby and be like, "Bro, you catch us?" That nigga was like, "Bro, I ain't even watching us." Bro. I'm not tolerating. No, we ain't want to game in three weeks. Man. Yeah, like, bro, bro, I'm not watching. Yeah, what's up, man? Y'all suck, man. man. I'm sitting there, bro. Even though, like, like I watched, I watched us in basketball. Oh Jesus Christ! Knowing how bad no, we were. Hey, listen, I caught the early. Okay, I was. The goddamn uh when we went to the Bahamas to hoop. All right. We lost every game by an average of twenty one points. We lost to We didn't go to the Bahamas. We went to Hawaii. It was whatever. We went to one of them islands and got it was the Maui and, tournament. And got beat up. The Maui tournament. Whatever it was. Maui I knew we was in trouble when we lost to uh Arkansas. Shit, I was okay. I knew he was in trouble. Lost to Texas Tech 
Arkansas was a way better basketball school than Texas I knew Tech. We, in trouble. we lost to Bellamere. That too. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> oh. Oh shit. Oh my God. We Bro, we won four, four games. Oh shit. Oh, bro, I just, bro, you just reminded me. Bro, we lost to Bellamere, and I was like, bro, we oh, lost shit. to that other school that, like, because Bellamere beat Kentucky too. Listen though, we lost to a school. I think they beat Kentucky. Or listen, like, they competed. Listen, but like, bro, we got no. Yeah, they didn't beat Kentucky. They, 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 they played. Good. It was but a team. listen. We lost to a school before the Bellamere game, bro. We lost and to every a game school was like by one. Listen, we lost to a school that when you looked them up, it don't even show you the box score for the game. It just shows the fucking score. The school doesn't even exist. We lost to them. We lost to Bellarmine. Then we lost to uh, then we lost to App State by I think one. We lost to uh, everything uh, was by like. Uh, no, I feel like we lost to no Norfolk like State by points. one. And it was like, come on, y'all, bro. We was at, bro. It was bad, bro. And like, but I but not I, to get back on basketball. No, 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 we, we no, no, I, I, I gotta get this off. Okay, I get this off. This is real quick. Real quick, real quick, real quick. You niggas, okay? All right. I love basketball. I love U of L basketball more than I love U of L football. Like it's just, just. I, I love U of L football. I, I love U of L football, but uh, I, I typically have had less concerns about U of L football because yeah. I, because my, what I expect from them is generally what I get from them. And it's like basketball has let me down. Basketball has some of the. The moments where I'm like, bro, this 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 too close for comfort. I mean, just maybe, maybe not as many moments as football. Football's had a lot of bullshit ass moments where I'm like, that was heartbreaking. But basketball is lately, bro. I don't have an issue with Kenny Payne. I got a little 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 tiff with Nolan Smith, bro, because he he applied. I seen some shit, bro. He applied for a coaching position for a team in the G League, right? It got out that he did that. Come, I have. I'm not the smartest person, bro. I'm not the smartest person, and maybe you, maybe he can enlighten me. Um, but I seen where he was saying, like, yeah, um, it got out, but it wasn't supposed to get out that I was auditioning for a coaching position in the G League, but I was never leaving Louisville, huh? The 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 the, 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 the college the college the college basketball season and the G all that shit runs hand in hand. So you gonna be a, a college basketball coach and do the G like so that means you're not fully committed. I'm be honest with you, bro. I love Kenny Payne. I think Kenny Payne is dope. I think Kenny Payne's gonna do a good job, but his lead assistant cannot be one foot in, one foot out. So if you was trying to he go shoot that free throw like that. If, if you was trying to go, bro, then like you you just gotta go, bro. Like that's how I feel. I, I I don't I don't agree with the whole notion. I don't agree with the notion that he was like, oh, I was just, yeah, I I, I applied for the position, but I was never I was never leaving Louisville. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Yeah, he was. I, to- I I I don't believe that. Maybe you could tell Boo Boo the fool that, but I personally don't believe that. So, but that's another story. I mean, for another I feel day. like he only left Duke because he wanted that head coach. He wanted to. He knew he uh, wasn't gonna get it, and they gave it to Paulus, which. They should have. I feel like they gave it to Paulus. They gave it to Paulus. Like it is. It is what it is. Like so. It's like because to me, he seemed like he was more closer to Coach K, anyways. And like he, like if you look at Duke, there's really not much difference to the way that they play. No, not at all. The way that they play, the way that they recruit, the way that the defense is, the way that the offense, offensive plays, everything, bro, looks like Coach K still coaching. Yeah, but just not winning. As if Coach K still coaching. But we'll 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 get on basketball because basketball season around the corner. They made a great run in March, but. Who? Duke. Oh, I thought you were talking about Louisville. I said, nigga, no, Duke. Please. They, no, made, a, I'm not. they made a run to the offseason. A lot of them niggas made a run to the transfer report. So yeah, that too. Um, which they needed to go. Uh, which, man, what, what? I think L. Ellis transferred to Arkansas. Good riddings. Or somewhere he transferred to. Somewhere. Good riddings. I like L. Not I, as not, a not, point guard. No, he, no, he's not a point guard. Definitely not a point guard. But I, I, I liked his game. Um, But anyway. Back to football, uh, I think we're good. A lot of them like one point games and five point games, bro, was on him. No, for like sure. his decision making. No, it's just no, like sure. I get it, bro. Like you call, like literally, you are the best player on the court for us. But like at the same time, bro, his decision making skills were not point guard oriented. He's definitely a score first, not a pass first. No, no, he's definitely a Lou, a Lou Will ass nigga. 
He's not a point guard. He's a, that ain't got the skill. He, he's a small two guard. Undersized. Undersized two guard. Yeah. yeah. But um, back to football, bro. Um, I think we're good. I think I think we are going to be pit. Um, we I think we we me personally, other people might say other, but we do have two very tough games left. We do have Miami and we do have UK. Um, True. Miami is beatable because from what I saw this weekend, they're not disciplined. I think um, the only um, I think, I think the, UK I think right is now beatable. They got the they got the point. Who? Uh, Miami, just because the game's in Miami. Well, yeah, yeah. I mean, I feel like you got. I mean, they're still like right, on the over like, under. Yeah, yeah like, they're, they're, they're they're like I said, Miami's not a not a bad team. I just think that they lack discipline. I think last Saturday showed that. The coaching between coaching and player, like, yeah, the coach shouldn't have ran the ball. The player has to hold on to the ball. Like, the coach shouldn't have put his team in that situation. But on defense, it's the last play of the game. You are the deepest man. You have one rule. Nobody gets behind, nobody gets behind you, bro. I nobody, mean, nobody, that's... bro. You don't, bro. You have you. It's it's almost like if if if. If, if if we're playing a team that's middle school, pop Warner, high easy school. as shit. It's it, it's just like if you playing if you got containment, if you 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 set the edge, nobody gets on the outside, bro. You, you have one job. Yeah, fam, you have one job, bro. I'm I watched I, I I'm watching it live. This after the Louisville game ended, they switched to that game. I'm watching it live, bro. Quarterback rolls out. He's thirty yards away from the safety. <laughs> hey, big hey. Big dog, you're not going to make that tackle. You have no reason to even bite on the quarterback taking off. Yeah. His dumb ass come running full speed. Wide receiver just da, 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 right past him over the head. Wasn't even a good – just uh, stole it up. I couldn't believe it, bro. One, one of the worst – bro, before the fumble, Miami had a 99.9% .9 chance of winning. Do you know – how bad of a loss that is, bro. It's horrible. All they had to do was take a knee. That's it. All they had to do was take a knee, bro. Yeah. 